We at Prisma are very excited to announce a new tool we've been working on called Try Prisma. What this tool does is it allows you to set up an example project with Prisma already configured in it so that you can try out Prisma in a project with a stack you want to work with without having to go through all of the steps of setting it up yourself. So let's take a look at what this tool does. In case you aren't already familiar, Prisma has a GitHub repository called Prisma Examples where we have a collection of different example projects that use Prisma. These example projects use JavaScript or TypeScript, and there's a bunch of different other ones where we try different databases and different deployment platforms. And currently, if you want to set one of these up, you'll have to clone down the repository of your choice. You'll have to install all of your NPM modules. You'll have to perform a migration, seed your database, and then you can jump in and start working with your project. So there's a bunch of different steps you have to do. What Try Prisma does is it consolidates all of that down into one CLI command, and it takes you through a little wizard where you get to pick your project, and it sets it all up for you. To get started, head over to a terminal of your choice and type in the command npx try prisma. When you hit enter on this, it's gonna load up all of the example projects that are available through the CLI. And these are gonna be all of the projects in the TypeScript and JavaScript folders in that repository I just showed you. We're gonna pick TypeScript. For the project, I'm gonna pick a TypeScript GraphQL server. And I'll say, yes, I'd like to install the packages automatically. And then I could choose which package manager I'd like to use. And I'm gonna use npm. And then finally, the project name and the default output directory. And at this point, it's going to download that repository. It's going to run npm install for me, which might take a couple of seconds. And then once it's done with that, it's going to spit out a couple of instructions on where to go from there. The first thing is to navigate into the folder. And then after that, it walks you through performing a migration. So let's open up the project and see what we have. Within the project directory, what you're going to find is a fully set up application. We have our node modules here, which we installed automatically. We have our Prisma folder, where we have our initial schema. This comes with the project. And we have a seed file, which will be run to seed your database. Finally, you have the source directory where the entirety of your application will be. So in this example, we have a basic GraphQL server. So following the instructions that the terminal output told us about, we can now run a migration to actually set up our database and seed it with some data. So what we're going to run is npx prisma migrate dev dash dash name init. And what we're going to see here is that our migration took place, our database was seeded, and it should be ready to go. Our hope for this tool is that it helps you get up and running much quicker with Prisma in a stack that you would like to use. If you have any feedback, there's multiple places throughout the CLI wizard where you can submit feedback to us. If you think there's any projects missing, there's also a link in the CLI output where you could submit any potential missing projects. And if you're curious about looking at the GitHub repository so you can get up and running quickly, there's gonna be a QR code on the screen right now where you can go and it'll take you right to the repository. So we hope you'll give this a try and thanks so much for watching.